Hello friends, welcome to the world of uh, online flight simulation where simulation meets reality. Also welcome to the IVO network. This is Deb Madia and I will help you with all the steps which are needed to become a pro flight simmer in this community. I promise you if you watch my video series you will see the silver lining very soon. So without further delay, let's wear our seat belt and be ready for takeoff. So today we will learn the first step that will help us to begin our journey in this flight sim world. In order to fly as a pilot, you need to connect to the IVO network. So first of all, you need to go to www.ivao.aero. After going there, you need to login. So once I after clicking the login button, you need to fill your VID and your IVO website password. There are two passwords. One is for IVAN password and another is the website password. So you need to put in the website password here. Then you need to click on login. Once the page loads, you need to go to resources, software. On this page we have the IVO ATC client, the pilot client and the network utilities. Since we are here looking for being a pilot on this sim world so we will click on the pilot client. Now this pilot client comes for Microsoft Flight Simulator 2004 or Microsoft Flight Simulator X. Explain version 8, 9, 10, 11 and for prepare 3D. Then you need to click on download. Once you click on download you will get all the download options for the various flight sims. Let's suppose we will use for Microsoft Flight Simulator X and prepare 3D. So you need to click on this button and click on version 2.2 which is current. And you need to choose a server. And it, the software will start to download. So let the software get downloaded. I'll get back to you then. So the software has downloaded. Now we'll open it. run this exe file and let the setup begin so you need to click next you need to accept the agreement then you need if you have a single pc you need to click single else you need to choose according to the options then click next uh, your flight simulator x folder will be already there and uh, you need to click next again now the mtl installer is very important you, you should run it it is mandatory so you need to check mark yes, yes option and click on next then you need to select uh, if you are a full screen viewer select that else if you use your flight sim in windowed mode select the windowed mode and press next then it will tell you that you the installed version of FSUI PC and what version is there available in the installer if it's high you don't need to install it select no if it's lower obviously install it then select uh, where you would like to set up the IVO uh, this uh, IVAP client uh, select the location and click next You need to install this TeamSpeak voice client. It is a software which is used for communication purpose. So it is mandatory that you install this also. Then you need to click next and 
Stadion. This is the MTL installer. It is uh, recommended that you download and uh, do a full install. It will take some time because it is almost around 5 GB. Uh, so it's uh, obviously it's uh, recommended as as it's written. Full install should be done. And you need to select the server and press next. So this process will take around an hour or two depending upon your internet connection. Since I have uh, all the MTLs installed, I have cancelled it, but you should do it uh, till the end. And then click next to install uh, TeamSpeak, and uh, then the installation is done. So, friends, uh, this is how you need to do the installation of iWAP. Hope you have uh, liked the video. Uh, if you like the video, smash the th th thumbs up button. Subscribe to my channel to get regular updates, and also comment to let me know if it was helpful for you. So in the next video I will tell you how to set up the TeamSpeak server which is used for communication purpose. So captains uh, see you soon in the virtual sky. Take care.